All right, the heart disease is the number one cause of death in America, killing nearly one million Americans every minute. Excuse me, one American every minute. But there are simple tests that can save your life. I just did them. Health fair buses like this one here travel the country to provide the screenings. They tested me this morning, and I'll show you how I did. I actually don't know. Joining us right now to tell us how you can do if you have the opportunity to get on one of these buses for $179, it can happen to you. Co-founder Terry Diaz and Health Fair's Chief Medical Officer, Dr. Robert Orstaglio. Welcome to both of you to the show. Thank you. Thank you. What's Thank you. behind Thank you. us? Well, this is one of our mobile units. This is what the units that we take all over the nation. We have right. 18 of these. The idea is to do prevention tests to bring awareness that you can find diseases before they cause a problem. And it looks like a, a mini waiting room, mini doctor's office. Look, guys, let's go inside. Sure. Uh, this could pull up to your workplace. It could uh, pull up to your office. And you could sit there and you have a waiting room just like any other uh, doctor's office. Uh, over here, of course, you don't want to be 12 deep. And then inside, Chris, is uh, if you want to turn around and right over there, it's a simple uh, is a simple examining room, right, doctor? Yes, indeed. Uh, it's a private room, and uh, the door would close. You'd have all your tests uh, in there uh, in the in privacy of the room. All right, and, uh, and what we're doing, Terry, too, is uh, you're going to go through three major tests, correct? That's correct. You're going to have an uh, ultrasound of the heart, an ultrasound of the carotid artery in your neck, and an ultrasound of the aorta, which is the main artery coming out of the heart. Now, doctor, you've been doing this since like '98, correct? That's you've been correct. driving around. You've been driving around. What you're doing is finding, maybe in 25% of the cases, something, a problem, a ticking time bomb. You always wonder, where, where did the stroke come from? He looked or she looked fine. You're saying if you get this done, you could stop that. Well, potentially you can stop that. Certainly we'll have the information uh, concerning the carotid artery. If we see plaque buildup, yes, indeed, we can assess the severity of it and then uh, give that person that information to make those decisions. So you got about, what, 18 across the country? 18 across the country. That's what, absolutely. It's, it's fantastic. 179 bucks. The insurance, for the most part, picks up, what, 75% of this? Yes, that's correct. And this morning I got here a little bit early. I took two of the three tests that you would give in about 15 minutes. Yes. Is it time to uh, to go over some of the results? Sure. All right, look, do you want to go outside for this? Because Chris has just put his camera down and pointed me outside. Uh, I'll put down my time, Tom Jones microphone, and we'll come out here. Doctor, that is my heart, correct? Yes, that is your heart right there on the screen. And what, what test are you giving me right there? Well, this is the echocardiogram. We're taking a look at your heart in the various chambers. I'm pointing out the various chambers of your heart right there, uh, the right side of the heart and the left side of the heart. Blood is coming in from the lungs to the left side of the heart, going into what we call the right. left ventricle, which is contracting, and then taking the blood and uh, contracting it out to the right. systemic uh, And Terry, you look worried. What's your results of that test for me? <laughs> uh, that test looks entirely normal. Right, so I do have a heart. Yes, That's good. <laughs> uh, the walls aren't too thick and the blood seems to be flowing. Yes, that's correct. The second test you did was right on my neck. Looking at the artery, right. this is blocked, get strokes. Yes, indeed. Uh, the worsening blockage, the higher the risk for a stroke. So we can actually look at the carotid artery, we can see if there's plaque buildup, and we can assess based upon the blood flow characteristics whether there's a ser serious blockage or not. All right, Terry, you looked at my carotid artery. Yes. You saw blood flowing to the brain despite the way I've been over the first hour, <laughs> and it reveals what? Uh, your carotid artery was nice and clean. There was no plaque buildup, and the blood flow characteristics right. were normal. Terry, if somebody like me or somebody else over the age of 35 comes in here, in terms of saving health care costs, what are we doing? Oh, well, this because we, we bring this so, so affordably, and it's convenient, and we bring it to the community, we go to gyms, we go to fitness centers, this is health care reform at its best. All right, you have health care right on our plaza here. The health fair has come to you. It's a great way to stay ahead of the curve. Cost a lot of money to be brought by an ambulance to the emergency yes, room indeed. and a long hospital stay, this could avoid all that. That's yes, correct, indeed. yes. All right, and what about television? Does that bring a really, uh, does that uh, expedite the chances of a heart attack? Because it is live. Does that bring up the stress level? Well, it brings up your stress level, that's correct. Right. So. You did fantastic, well, Doctor. You, you really much. know your stuff. It. And Terry, thanks for doing thank this. Thank you very much. All right, uh, come out to the Plaza 47th and we'll check you out. We'll take your shirt off and look inside. Back to you guys. Inside uh, your heart. All right, All Brian. Right, Brian. We always great. knew you had a heart. Thank goodness it's healthy, too.